Cagayan de Oro City knows firsthand the impact of a changing climate. One night in December in the year 2011, disaster struck when water from the rain-drenched hinterlands came rushing down through the Cagayan de Oro River, flooding riverside communities, drowning entire families as they slept, and sweeping hundreds out to sea. Never again became Cagayan de Oro's battle cry as no build areas were cleared out. And fail-safe alarm and evacuation systems put in place, earning for our City Disaster Risk Reduction and Management Office consecutive awards for disaster preparedness. Once largely disaster-innocent citizens, hard set against leaving their homes, now voluntarily troop to evacuation centers at the first fleet of the siren. For this reason, the city government of Cagayan de Oro and its outstanding design team, composed of prominent members of the city's academe, as well as architectural, engineering, and scientific circles, have chosen to create a city evacuation center as its entry in the Livable Cities Design Challenge. The building will be called Oro Central to serve the dual purpose of dispensing knowledge and ensuring safety thereby safeguarding the future of our city and its citizens. The site for the City Evacuation Center is the City Central School Compound. According to the study conducted by the Engineering Resource Center of Xavier University Ateneo de Cagayan and based on the geohazard map generated by the city's Geographic Information Systems or GIS, it is the least flood-prone and most accessible. It is located along a main thoroughfare right next to the Don Gregorio Pelaez Sports Center with five hospitals and numerous pharmacies within a two-kilometer radius. The city central school compound is immediately recognizable and in fact already serves as a polling place and evacuation site on numerous occasions. It is historically significant as the first school established in Cagayan de Oro, with two of its buildings enshrined as heritage structures. Primarily, the City Evacuation Center will be used as a school with classrooms. The original building and site were used for the same purpose, but a fire that occurred a few years ago caused structural damage and rendered the entire building unfit for use. Since a major evacuation center is already under construction to serve the west side of the Cagayan de Oro River, Oro Central will serve the area east of the Cagayan de Oro River and at the same time address the lack of classrooms in City Central School. As such, and in keeping with the city government's pioneering initiative to design all public school classrooms, henceforth, Constructed to serve the dual purpose of education and evacuation, the Cagayan de Oro City Design Team conceptualized this paragon of the perfect union between architectural vision and operational functionality. Upon the occurrence of a disruptive event requiring evacuation and transfer of command operations, the building will serve its secondary purpose as the city's command and evacuation center. Come what may, Cagayan de Oro is armed with the ultimate implement in any eventuality, and this tool is called Unity. Unity in design and functionality, as well as unity and cooperation between the public and private sectors. Unity has been the greatest factor in Cagayan de Oro's favor that has been instrumental in its resilience and continues to work to its advantage.